Hello everyone and welcome to Bumpy. Today's video is a challenge. We need to go to Dollar Tree and spend no more than $20 and use it as our Christmas home decor. So I want to give a special thank you to Eclectic Kristen for hosting this collab. And we will have the link below with the playlist of all the other talented YouTubers. So I picked up several items from the Dollar Tree and I've actually was able to do uh, a couple of different projects. So let's get started with the first DIY. Price needed for project number one, we will be doing a hanger for your door. We need one poinsettia, two of these snowflakes, one package of the five piece Merry Christmas, another package that come in five piece of the reindeer, one reindeer head, twine, a roll of burlap, a ribbon, a roll of ribbon, and also a door wreath hanger. Now you can choose different colors. There's gold, there's whites, there's blues. Um, this is the colors I chose and the patterns I chose. This is just an idea to get you ideas of home decors that you can do, but you can definitely choose your theme and your mood. The buffalo plaid ribbon to the edge of the burlap ribbon, as you can see here. Now I'm going to go ahead and do the same here, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this one here, the burlap, on the edge of the buffalo plaid. So this burlap one is going to be in the middle. I went ahead already and glued my ribbon, and I cut about 37, 38 inches long. I've already trimmed the bottom. So it looks nice and neat over here. I've already made a bow with the remaining ribbon of the burlap and the buffalo plaid. And I already went ahead and glued the bow and I glued the Merry Christmas ornament as you can see here to the bow. Okay. So now for the rest of the items, we're going to place the poinsettia. Kind of in the middle, we're going to place the star right under the bow, and then the other star snowflakes right here at the bottom. I don't know if you can see that over here. So that's how we're going to place these. Then we're going to go ahead and we're going to glue two of these reindeers. One we're going to glue right over here, and the other taking out this little. And then the other we're going to glue right at the bottom here. Okay? Then we're going to go ahead and place our deer head right here in the middle right over here okay so let me go ahead and glue these items and then I will come back How adorable this is so with the wreath holder what I did is I took my twine and I wrapped it all the way around so it looks nice and decent there you go And you can definitely use this also on the wall. And I think that's where I'm going to put it. Project number two, you're going to need a package of Dollar Tree uh, ornaments, a ribbon of your choice. I chose this uh, burlap, scissors, and glue. And all you're going to do is wrap your one inch ribbon as you cut it around your whole entire ornament and add a twine bow and you have upscaled these Dollar Tree 
ornaments into a much fancier look. Three, two kitchen towels from Dollar Tree. They have a lot of different colors and different patterns. I chose the buffalo plaid. The remaining leftover of your burlap ribbon that you did for project one. And then this package of six snowflake ornaments. Can you tell that these were Dollar Tree dish towels? So I just simply glued the remaining of the burlap left from my project one, the snowflakes, and then I made just these little bows with the twine. I love it. I think it looks so expensive. It was really easy. I spent here five dollars. So my total project cost for all the stuff that we just did was only a total of fifteen dollars. So I got this Dollar Tree sign and I just tied it to my lamp. I got this gold star and added it to a Dollar Tree. Christmas tree for one dollar. The little Santa bucket and then the 20 count plug-in lights. As you can see here I decided to put the wall hanging, the door hanging actually on the wall by the Christmas tree. So that's it guys, I spent a total of $15 in this Dollar Tree challenge. I want to thank all the other YouTubers who participated in this challenge. We'll have a playlist linked below and if you haven't subscribed, do so by clicking right over here. Thank you and I'll see you in the next